day, Toy Testing Girls. Good day. Sarah, your um, point about the Twilight merchandise was absolutely brilliant. I know. I Like, ever since um, Summit went into producing it, everything just exploded. And it was just, it's completely driving me insane. So, anyway, I got a new book. Alright, this whole outfit, alright? And, um, it's Revolutionary Road, and it's lovely. Wait, no! I have to pee. So I started filming it. Everything just exploded. Did you notice that? And at first I was like, awesome! Twilight t-shirts that are cafe pressed. And, yeah, I just made it into a verb. Alright, t-shirts that aren't cafe pressed. You know? And then... I like I totally agree with you on like the body glitter and stuff and I'm like, wow, that is way too far. Like everywhere you go. Um, I was at Barnes and Noble the other day. They have like five shelves full of Twilight books. And I'm like, wow. And I know I'm really gonna get punched in the face for saying this, but there are better books out there. Honestly. It's crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. Um alright, so uh I used to make my video from a different angle. I think it's that way. Is the sidebar, or you can click right here on my finger. I learned that from Dan Brown. There'll be a link to a video. It's Oh Holy Night, but it's Sarah. You don't have to watch it. Sarah, I've already seen it. Um, it's really funny. It is. It's really really funny. I had it on my choir panel. Like we had to describe it. You know, if it was fast, slow, choppy, smooth, um, loud or soft. You know, stuff like that. Okay. So, next thing, uh, I'm not going to challenge anybody last week, and I said you made a really good point. I really shouldn't have challenged anybody last week. So, I'm not going to, and if you, you we are recasting, I guess, but if you're not going to post videos, can you let us know so we can know what spots we have to kind of fill? Because that'd be really, 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 really great. So, I got, um, we have a... Yeah, it's on Saturday. Uh, I'm taking Kelsey and Amanda, too. They're my dates. Oh, yeah. Two of them. And, uh, here's my ticket. It's blue, and it's ticket number 30. So, I'm really excited. I'm going to shopping on Friday. Uh, Amanda, okay. Amanda. Um, she was asking this guy in our gym class, and, um, I wanted to be there, and I didn't have my last period with her. So I was like, you have to do it now, you have to do it now. And she's like, well, how do I do that? I'm all hot and sweaty. So I know it's really hot to be all hot and sweaty right now and be coming out of gym, but will you go to snowball with me? So she did that, and he's like, I'm, oh, excuse me. He's like, I'm not going to snowball now. It was really sad. She called him a pansy boy. Last thing I have to talk about is dance class last night was so much awesome. Like, it was really, really funny. Like, basically what happened is, uh, my friend Brittany had this little, like, short-lived fetish of pulling down people's pants. So, um, my friend Lindsay comes in to dance. She's got on her sweatpants, and then shorts under that. So, she, Brittany's like, Lindsay, can I pull down your pants? And she's like, okay. So, she kind of, like, holds her shorts in place, but, um, Brittany had grabbed onto the layer of shorts, too, and just jacked them down. Okay, and guess who's right there? That's good, too. Okay. He's a guy, his, he's called Carson, and he thinks that I am stalking him, which I am not. So do not ever be a person that spaces off. Don't ever do that. That is really bad. Don't ever be a person that spaces off, because that is why he thinks I'm stalking him, because I always space out, apparently right around him. So I, look, I just kind of look... And it's always around him, which is... Just terrible. So, yeah, he was right there, and he's like, whoa! And I was like, I died laughing. And I like, okay, okay, going back to stalk stalkers. I don't think that I'm stalking him, I think he's stalking me. Yeah, I've just kind of like reversed it and just shoved it into his face right now. Oh yeah, editing skills for the win. Apparently this is my cut. Anywho, uh, because I see him everywhere, and I'm like, wow. Like, today he was walking out of the school, and I was just kind of standing there with Olga. We were waiting for brother ponies. And so he walks out, then he walks back in, 
And it looks like he's going to go down this hallway, but no, he comes around me where I'm standing and then continues down the hallway. Bye.